Hi everyone, welcome to this video. This video is my nail polish project 2018 update number three for the month May and June. So this is how my tray looks like right now. Uh, these ones are the nail polishes I haven't used at all uh, this past two months. And on this side, you have the nail polishes that I, I have been using and uh, treatments and things. And yeah, I'm going to start actually first with the items that I have used up. In May, I didn't use up that many items, but I do have some. First off, I used up this Essie Good As Gone nail polish remover. It's 25 milliliters, so it's not that much, but it's something. Uh, it was actually down to here uh, last time I did um, the update, I think, yeah. And then I used this up. Uh, I also used up this Essie all-in-one nail polish and when I started it was there and last update was here and then it just yeah ended it's only five milliliters so it's not that much I'm actually gonna see one more soon and uh, I did use up one nail polish with color this is the OPI uh, key, um, super cute in pink so here are the markings on the side and I have the swatch stick here, super cute in pink. I say it's not pink, it's more purple for me, I think. I did use up this, this is kind of a, yeah, it's a um, compressed cleaning, what is it, in English? Cleaning pad for nails and spatula, so I've been cleaning my uh, instruments. And my mom found a whole lot of them and she was like, Danny, you can use them. So I have still a lot of them. And the last thing I did use in May was this Footner Exfoliating Socks. And oh my god, my feet were <laughs> really peeling. But now I have been using a thing for my feet again and they have started to peel again. And even worse. So yeah. In June, I was in Spain for three weeks and I have used up some items. First up is this Bath & Butter Works uh, Raspberry Pink Peony Hand Sanitizer. It's one fluid ounce or 29 milliliters. Um, yeah, it's all gone and very, really, really rubbed off. Um, I have used up, well, I'm throwing this. This is my cleaning brush that I've been using for around my uh, cuticles. And I'm going actually today to US, so I'm going to buy uh, e.l.f. Um, brushes instead that I used to have. Um, I have used up a package of uh, cotton rounds. Um, this is actually from Spain. And uh, yeah, painted our nails and everything, and so I used use this up I have also let's see here I have also used up first of all this bridge filling base coat from Viva La Diva it was up to here and I do have something left but the the metal balls that are in there they they are in the way so I can't get anything out I have used up also one more top coat. This is the mini gel setter, five milliliters from Essie. And it was here when I started, so it has to be then in June and, no, in May. And then this was like the last thing I got out from it. I did use up a nail polish with color. It's the Essie Meet Me at Sunset. It's also one of these small ones. It's just five milliliters. So I was at the first line and then now in June I was here and it disappeared. That's the one I have had for my tote. And it looks like this. Sorry, right there. Looks like this. Meet me at sunset. So yeah. So we're gonna talk now about the nail polishes I have used. So this corner, and you saw my flower pots and they suck. <laughs> Uh, first off, we have this. This is OPI DS Extravagance. And I am down to here, so it's not that much left. It's very, very like really, really little, and I don't know how to get it out, but I will manage somehow. 
I have this H&M Manhunter and it's here and you can almost see through the bottle because I was stupid and took too much thinner when I needed to thin it out. Then we have this, this is Essie Spaghetti Straps. I used it for one manicure and as you can see it went from line number two to line number three and it's not that much left. I have used this, the penned protecting base coat but it didn't show up the line so it's still on the same second line you can see here um, let's see so I don't push anything down this is the L'Oreal um, liner French pre precision I have used it but it didn't make a mark um, or change of the mark here's one of the uh, nail polishes from the Hello Kitty collection and now I don't remember the name but I have used it, it was up to here first well my mom has used it it was here and when she used it it went down to here and then when she had painted her nails she was like I don't like this color and took it away I did some flowers and I used this but it hasn't even made a change in the marking so but I have used it here we have a jello this is oh also from the Hello Kitty, it's my twin Mimi. So it was here and now it's down to here. This is actually going with me to US now on a trip. We have here a milk bottle from the from the Hello Kitty collection. So it went from the second line to the third line. We have the, well this is a new one I have been using. It's the Essie Mini Gel Couture Top Coat. So I had this with me now in Spain, so what I started and I'm kind of here, it's kind of hard to see through this bottle, but I did shine a light and I think I'm right here where the eye is. This is also coming with me to US. Uh, here we have, oh this is um, Outrageous, no, something uh, purple, it's from the Outrageous Neon collection. I have used it but it didn't make a mark to change, like make a difference to make the mark. Um, here we have Jinx, I also used it. I did use this for when I made a pineapple and yeah, it didn't make a huge impact so I haven't gotten second a uh, third mark on it, but I have used it. Uh, the thing I have on my nails right now is this Big Apple Red. I have used it, it went from line number three to line number four. We have this one, this is Lincoln Park After Dark. So it's been used. So yeah, as I said before my dad interrupted, this is Lincoln Park After Dark. It was new and I painted my friend's nail, nails actually uh, and I'm going to take this with me to US too. Something that is new for this uh, uh, um, project is this Sesh Base Reach Filling Base Coat because since I used up the Viva La Diva, I have to have a new one. So I replaced it with this, and it's also going with me with, to US. Then I have here my, well, nail color removal from H&M. It's soon, very, very soon gone, so it's not that much. I have the Echo Pure uh, hand cream. It's, I thought I could have used it up by now because it's not that much left. It's more like air here. So this is just deceiving that it looks so much, but it's not. But I'm not taking this with me to US because it's so big a package. I am gonna take this with me. This is the rituals, ritual of ritual of Ayur, Ayurveda, the ancient art of living wifely hand balm. And this is a small one. It's only 10 milliliters, and I have used it. As you can see, it's starting to taper down. But that is coming with me, and I was. I'm planning on taking this with me, but it's just so little. I think I'm going to buy uh, a nail polish remover in US. Then we have the Ethos hand oil or nail oil. Uh, I'm not going to take this with me. Uh, I have used it, but it's not that much. Uh, since I used up the Raspberry Pink Peony hand sanitizer, I'm taking this with me, the beautiful day. So yeah, that is what I'm taking with me. And this is how it looks like right now. I'm gonna change it up uh, so I have it all like clear 
so everything is from the fresh start and yeah hopefully I can uh, make it uh, to December and use up a little bit more because I still have I think I counted it 30 nail polishes but uh, okay majority are uh, small ones so uh, that's an advantage but I still have a lot so yeah that was everything I hope you have a nice day and 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 great summer and I see you in the next one bye bye